This is your CBS 46 News update, brought to you by West Shore Home. Good evening, I'm Sean Gables. Tonight, the man who touched millions on and off the field is in his final resting place. He is grafted in the minds and the hearts of everybody here and everybody looking all around the world. Hank Aaron memorialized in a tribute fit for the home run king. Within the last hour, a procession took Aaron's body from Friendship Baptist Church to the Southview Cemetery to be buried. On the way, the line of cars rounded the home run wall at the site of the former Atlanta Fulton County Stadium. That's where Aaron famously passed Babe Ruth's home run record. The procession following a three hour long funeral service today for Aaron, the world said goodbye. This all happened at Friendship Baptist Church in Atlanta. It was an intimate ceremony, private, with about 50 people only. Former President Bill Clinton was there and spoke about Hank endorsing him for president. We also heard from Ambassador Andy Young on Aaron's contributions in spirit, which no doubt changed Atlanta for the better. Some of Aaron's dearest friends and grandchildren also shared stories about the late great baseball player. Found in a little shop in Savannah that says, I don't want them to forget Babe Ruth. I just want them to remember me. Grandfather, thank you for your love and your guidance. And I'll miss you <laughs> every day. Other well-known speakers at the service included Jimmy Carter, Ed Turner, and Bob Costas. You can rewatch our coverage on Hank Aaron on CBS46.com and the free CBS46 streaming app. We've got a photo gallery showcasing the highest professional moments of Aaron's life, as well as details about his off-the-field accomplishments. We do have cold, windy conditions moving in tonight. Temperatures dropping to the mid-30s. We'll see wind gusts up to 30 miles an hour. It will stay windy overnight and during the day on Thursday, especially Thursday morning. Temperatures will be in the mid-30s with 30 mile an hour wind gusts. The wind chill will be in the 20s and by the afternoon will warm to the mid-40s. But with the winds, it will feel like it's in the mid-30s. So grab those thick winter coats. You will need them. You will need sunglasses as well, although cold and windy tomorrow. Tomorrow will be sunny. In fact, the rain doesn't return until this weekend. This has been your personal news update from CBS 46 News, brought to you by West Shore Homes, Atlanta's one-day bath remodeler.